What will you do? Ah, oh, this is a good one. What will you do if your son got bullied? If my son goes to school and comes back and says, Dad, I'm getting bullied. I'll say to him, you're not coming back to this house until you go back to school and punch him in his face. I don't give a fuck what the teachers say or do, because obviously we know what it's, well, we knew what it was like when we was going to school, yeah? let alone now. You got these kids dressing up like people that they're not supposed to dress up. You get what I'm trying to say, not trying to get the live stream blocked and that. I'm going to tell my son, punch that boy in his face. Don't come back to this house. I'm not going to feed you. You don't think I'm joking, blood. I'm not having my son get bullied, blood. Yeah? Because the only reason why that child is trying it is because he knows he can get away with it. You got to show bullies. Yeah? You fuck with me, you're going to hold something. Nobody wants a war. No one really and truly wants beef, blood. So they're only picking on people that they feel they can get away with it. Yeah? Remember, these are children as well. These are not no hardened criminals that stab up and shoot up people and that. And even man that stab up and shoot up, man, it's only because they're probably retaliating. Really and truly, no one wants a war. People just want to pick on and bully, man. Trust me. I know, man. Man that I know. Man that man roll with, you know. They were bullying up some youths on the other side until one day they said, fuck this, blood. And they started riding out and stabbing up, stabbing up until people started dropping and that. And I know deep down, them man there fought. If only we just left them. If only we just befriended them. Or if only we just pattern their man up so like we use them as like send outs and that yeah our lives would be much better yeah we would have more people alive right now yeah so no one wants a war trust me so these kids that are going around bullying people and that they're only doing it because they're not get away with it my son comes home and says that he's getting bullied and that go back to school i'll punch him in his nose bro it's as simple as that because bullies come in all shapes and sizes it's not just a fat kid in the in the playground. Yeah, it's not just a fat kid in the class who's been held back three grades or three classes, three years and that. No, bullies in the house. Yeah, parents bully the children. Siblings bully. Younger siblings can old, bully older siblings. Not just older siblings bullying younger siblings. And there's kids that bully their parents. Man got examples for all of them situations there. Uh, well, I've seen things happening and that. So, um, yeah, you, you go in a workplace, managers bully. Yeah? I mean, you really hear about um, an employee bullying a manager, but I mean, in the history of the world, it must have happened. But managers, oh, they're, they're known for bullying. I've had managers try it on me. I had to tell a man, shut your mouth, blood. Yeah, I got fired from the job. That's what you're going to have to do, fam. Because there's no way you could talk to me like that on the road. I'll move to you. So, um, I'm, I'm not having that, fam.